gravity, the water cycle, nature. All of these things are science, and we're gonna talk to kids all about it. Let's do science. Do you know what science is? Yeah, caterpillars turn into butterflies. How does it work? You have a caterpillar, how does it turn into a butterfly? Well, that is a story, actually. Oh, can you tell me that story? Uh-huh, once upon a time, there was a little egg hanging on a tree. That was the caterpillar. At Monday, he ate to one apple. Tuesday, he ate to two pears. And then what happened? He turned big and fat, and then plat. Big wings came out, and then he turned to a butterfly. Whoa, do you think you could do that? No, you only have to turn big and fat. You don't get the butterfly part? No. What do you, how could we do some science right now? Picking up something and like feeling how it feels and smelling it. All right, let's pick this up. So what does it look like? It looks like a leaf that has holes in it. Yeah, a little bit. The final test, ready? Yeah. All right, watch. What? Um. um. <laughs> what? Did you do what? Uh, uh. You ate a leaf. It was yucky. So what did we learn? <laughs> Leafs take gr taste gross. Maybe. Would you say that's science? Yeah. I do science about volcanoes, diamonds, a lot of stuff. What do you know about volcanoes? Lava. True. What do you know about diamonds? That's because they're like so shiny. Can you explain to Stokely why science is important? Stokely, science is important of things that we never done before. Well, I done before so most times with my cousins. Stokely, look at me. Science is something that we do to do stuff that's like fun, really epic, something like we never done before. Stokely. Science is a scientist thinks are actually things who invent stuff. Okay. What other things do you know about science? Well, I know about water. What do you know about water? Animals need water. Trees need water. Like the whole planet. <laughs> do you need water? Exactly. So you're telling me everything we see needs water. Do we need water to stay alive? Yes, you do. <laughs> But not buildings. What do they need? They need people. What is your favorite part of science? My favorite part is math. So like if we wanted to calculate how far proton would move in a second, we could use math, right? I don't even know what a proton is. Probably eight inches. How could we use math and science to figure out how old a dinosaur bone is? So we can check our calendar if we have one to see what year it is and then look up what year dinosaurs died in. Yeah. Can you name a scientist? Eric. Yeah, a scientist can be named Eric. Um, <laughs> how do you tell me about trains. You see how the wheels push the train on the track? That actually thrusts the train to go forward. Wow. What? Uh, who's this train? His name is Nate, and he's part of the Mighty Express team. Do you think there are train scientists? No. Maybe that's just a conductor. No, the conductor is the one who drives the train. <laughs> do you know about space? Well, I know rockets go to space. How do rockets fly? Because of the powerful engines on the bottom. A volcano works so quick, so quick. A volcano works by actually when there's lava underground and it comes up when it erupts. So quick. what do you think about that? It's a diamond. So you need to learn about science. Stokely, you need to learn about science. So Stokely, what have you learned from your brother today about science? Diamond fatal. Slime-tastic. If you do any science experiment, what would you do? I would do the slime, of course. What do you think like university scientists teach about? I think they teach about slime. <laughs> And biology, the most important part is slime. Yeah, I feel like scientists mostly just make slime, right? Yeah. Describe to me what a scientist look like. Scientist has 
head, a face, a mouth, and other body parts. Totally true. Why is science important? Because you have to be smart. Are you smart? Yes. How smart are you? A little. One plus two equals doing. But I know something about science. What? When? A, B, C, D, U. I think you're pretty smart. To be honest with you, you seem very smart to me. Yes. We're talking about science. What do you like about science? I like doing experiments to find out stuff. What kind of things have you learned from science? Learning about clouds at school and different types and like doing experiments. But what's your favorite thing about science? Like important stuff, like potions. I love science. Doing experiments. Yeah, what do scientists invent? Like machines, portals, anything. Whoa, wait, portals? What's a portal? When you go in a portal, you go to other dimensions. Yeah, yeah what do you say to kids who think science is boring? So science is not, is not boring, that's because science is really epic. How epic? Super epic. How super epic? Really, really epic. Really, how really, really super epic? Super duper hooper epic. Well, what do you think are in other dimensions? Like the 1973. The band? That's 1976. What do you think it was like in 1973? I haven't learned that yet. Oh, it's crazy, my friend. OK, you need to stand up and then I do something. Are you going to do science to me? Abacadabacadoo. Turn the people gone. Ta-da! Everybody else, learn science! Woo! Go science! What is, what is this? A what? A what? A what? What have you been doing with this? I don't think. What is this? 